Hey everyone, it is the Charming Giraffe, and today we are going to do another painting on an 8x10 canvas. And if you're a long term fan of this channel, you might know what we're about to do based off of this little contraption right here. I've used it in at least one prior video, but it will be a string pull. Um, this is going to be a lot different from my prior string pulls. It feels like it's been forever since I've done one. I think the last one was during our neon week a long time ago, um, where I did a whole bunch of neons. Um, this will be on a white base coat, and that's already down here. There we go. And I have a plan. <laughs> I don't know why I make these plans, because they very, very rarely work out, <laughs> but I have a plan. Let me see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, we got seven colors. Let me see if I can make something here. One, two, three, four, eight, okay. So, my plan is to take this very, very long piece of string. This is folded eight times over, so it's eight times this length. So my plan is to do one color per length. Oh no, I messed it all up. I've got to do it again. One second. <laughs> and then we're actually going to put it on the canvas in like a spiral. It's kind of the plan here. We'll see if this works out at all. Was very disappointed in the drips but now I'm actually liking them because of how kind of sporadic they are as well as how colorful they all are um, they're they're really pretty <laughs> so I am happy with that let me pop a few of these bubbles I am actually excited that this came out as well as it did. I was definitely concerned <laughs> and I am definitely happy. The only thing is this kind of 
awkward center here. There we go. We got it kind of more solidified. So yeah, we've got lots of stuff going on here. Let me bring you in for the close-up. All right, here we are for the close-up. We'll start just in the pink, and then we'll just go around in a circle. So this will be the lower right-hand corner from my point of view when it was being created. So we've got the pink and the blue kind of next to each other. And then this drip has like greens and yellows in it. And then we'll go up the right-hand side. We've got some more of that pink and blue and that blue blue and white drips in the pink. And then across we got the purple with blue and green drips in the purple. Then some green down the left-hand side. Back down to the blue and purple with some really pretty cells and lacing. Like I don't know if it can technically call it lacing, but some really pretty cells. And in the middle, we've got definitely got lacing with that red and um, white. And then it moves out to the orange and the yellow and the green with some like blue and light pink or orange strips. And then back to the green where we were on the left hand side. It's like a very colorful hurricane or something. I don't know what you would call it, but it's really pretty. Normally I'm not a fan of the drips. This is the one time I think I am a fan of the drips. <laughs> Uh, there just was no way to, to stop it, at least from being one person <laughs> trying to do it. I don't know how long that string was, but it was really, really long. So let me know what you think in the comments or if you have any tips or tricks or want me to try anything crazy like this um, in the future. Leave that all down below. I'll be happy to um, accommodate and try crazy things if you have any to uh, to suggest. So, yeah, sorry, I just can't stop looking at it. I do want to thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and do it makes you happy.